works? Okay. Hi everybody and welcome to my new YouTube channel. My name is Aline and I'm a student at the DCU University here in Dublin, so Dublin City University. I'm currently studying a Master's in Digital Marketing and as part of that Master's I need to do a portfolio, create a portfolio. And so one of my themes for my portfolio will be content marketing. So apart from this new YouTube channel that I'm going um, to make, um, I will have a blog and a podcast series which I will link down below. And today I'm actually going to do a vlog because I'm going over to Brown Thomas later after uh, going to college uh, for an event, uh, for a styling and beauty event that will be held there. And it's with uh, Instagrammer Lauren Bejawi. Um, yeah, and I'm quite excited, so I will take you with me because Brown Thomas events are actually quite nice, really nice. And I will show you around and take you with me down to uh, Dublin City. Sorry, I'm in the toilet of my business building right now. But basically, um, I just popped in um, a blazer from H&M that I bought uh, three weeks ago. I love the suiting trend right now. Um, it's really colorful with stripes and everything. I think the blazer was, I don't know, about 40, 45 euros. Um, I'll see if I can link it below also. Um, everything else is really old, like um, the t-shirt is from a time. I think I've had it for six, over six years or something. The jeans are secondhand from um, Beshka. It's basically mom jeans, I don't know if you can see it. Um, and then I just have um, fishnet stockings and my beloved Air Max Nikes that I got secondhand also. So I will be headed down like this, really bad hair day, uh, don't mind my makeup, um, I did it very quickly this morning, was late for classes and so yeah I'm going to head down there and I'll bring you with me on the way. Okay, hi, so as you can see it's actually quite sunny today in um, Dublin, um, on my way from the campus in Glasnev and to Brown Thomas. First time doing a vlog. Um, feel quite weird to be honest, to be filming myself in public. Um, but yeah, so it's really sunny but as you might see, um, even though we're already in spring, it's not that warm right now. Oh, so sorry for the lightning. Um, so we have like, I don't know, 13 degrees Celsius. Um, yeah, spring is taking a long time to arrive here in Dublin, but um, I'm on my way to take the bus to go uh, to the south side of Dublin, where Brown Town is situated across the Liffey River. Another thing you need to know is Dublin traffic is crazy. Um, I started to move like an hour ago and um, I only have 50 minutes until the event. I hope I will be fine. I just arrived in Grafton Street. I hope I get a seated place um, because the seats at these kinds of events like 
are rapidly like taken. Come on, and I don't know where it will be on the second floor around Thomas, so I need to see that. So yeah, I'll hope I get a place. To be fair, that is a really good one because it's double-ended. There's a liner on this side, which is kind of a slightly um, longer brush, and then this one is shorter. So it's really good if you want to do that real kind of feline cat eye, where you kind of, you know, you kind of draw down into the tear duct. So that'd be one, and I've got three left. Um, so another one for eyes, groundwork. This is just, well, any of the paint pots I think are amazing. Um, cream to powder, as I said, so they are long lasting. Like literally, a little bit on your finger, rub it on the eye and you're good to go. So that would probably be one of my desert islands, like just to kind of lift the eyes. Ooh, okay, I, I would have to. desert islands. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I know, priorities. No, it's really yes, I'll be burnt with Chris, but I have my paint pot. Um, I would put these guys together. So this would be another, this would be three. <laughs> so they kind of go hand in hand, it's the one brand. So definitely this, if guys, if you're looking for a new foundation, go down to the nearest counter and get them to colour match you, get a sample and try it out because it is like, it'll change your life, it's amazing. Again, for the same reason, you can't get a sample of it, but definitely go down and even try it on. A little bit goes a long way again with that. So um, <coughs> like you'll love it. Really, really try that, them out. So we're at, we'll be at three there, okay. Um, so four. I think I'd have to go with this one. Yeah. Like I think I'd have I to go with the bronzer. Her first girl in gorgeous casual. So this helmet and blazer, I absolutely love it. I frequently try it on. But I paired it with a gorgeous pair of cigarette pants from Victoria Beckham. The most asked question I ever get is, where do I get nice cigarette pants? What's a nice fit? Like, you always have nice pants. Where do you get your pants? <laughs> <laughs> but for me, trying these on, they just feel so amazing. They're super flattering. They're like quite a thick material. And then I paired them with a gorgeous little stripy t-shirt from Theory, and I adore these shoes. They're super comfortable little mules from Kirk Geiger so they're a really great price point to like if you want to get a trendy we have another gorgeous uh, Sandra suit this one is bright red so it's so eye-catching again we've just worn the little um, acne uh, jacket underneath just as more of a top as opposed to a jacket paired it with some gorgeous pointy heels and this Mimi bag is gorgeous and Kelly is wearing the exact same suit just more of a tighter fit so underneath we have da -da -da, the little Gucci t-shirt. Themed with any blazer, once it's oversized enough to cover you, of course. <laughs> Meant for the pointy heel. Sadly, the legs don't come with this look. <laughs> A gorgeous YSL bag to like tie it all together. So I chose the whole idea behind this and having one key piece three ways was like I used to be so bad in terms of fast fashion and I still do, I, I'll buy in Zara, I'll buy in Mango, just not as much. I was buying so much and I'd constantly do these massive closet clear outs and I would be binning or donating a, a ridiculous amount of clothes, there's no need for that. So I think since working here and the training I've received on brands and the amount of effort and quality that goes into them, I think like investing in such a key piece that will take you through all occasions, all looks, it's so important. And especially with the acne jacket, I'd say go down and like try it on and feel it. Um, gorgeous, gorgeous, look at these suits. I wish I could buy all of them. 
it's just gorgeous. Look at this. I need to show you this. So nice. Really nice. I love, love, love Victoria Beckham. No, no, if you hear me. But this is gorgeous. Look at these seats. Oh, nice, really nice. So yeah, that was the event. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. I'm on my way home. I need to finish an assignment and start another one that is due on Saturday and the one that I need to finish is due tomorrow. <laughs> so yeah, I'm going home um, finishing this assignment. So actually we got a little um, goodie bag which I didn't open and I'm going to unbox it only when I will be home. Oh look at this. This is my course in Max Mara. So nice. Really nice. Oh, and Hugo Boss. I used to work for Hugo Boss. That's the one thing you're going to know. Oh, I wish I could have had a look at the collection. Oh, and I used to work at Louis Vuitton also. So nice. Oh, one day, one day. And I hope to own this baby here by the end of my masters. I'll definitely invest in it. Like, I'm saving as crazy. This baby will be mine. Not for my 25th, but because I don't have time. But as soon as I finish my master, which is like two months later, I will own that baby. again so I'm going to the bus right now it's literally on the other side of Liffey, Liffey River or you need to walk for 20 minutes it's half past eight by now I think and yeah I absolutely need to run and I'm starving perhaps I'll grab something to eat on the way hey, um, welcome back um, I know I said I was going to do an unboxing of this magnificent goodie bag once I was back from um, the event at Brown Thomas. Remember it was really late, like 8.30 I think or something or even later. And I really needed to go back to finish my assignments. Um, that was three days ago. <laughs> so I'm really sorry I didn't finish the vlog. Um, I'm going to finish it and let's see what's in this goodie bag. I need to say, um, I opened it. <laughs> Because when you're writing two assignments and you're writing nearly 10,000 words in three days, you need something to, um, yeah, well, um, keep your hopes up. So I'm going to re-unbox it for you. So let's see what's in there. Oh, by the way, I love the bags from Brown Thomas. I think they're so cute and so stylish, minimalist, uh, with a cute bow on the top and, yeah. So first thing, um, first things actually, not really exciting, but um, I think it's actually quite exciting. It's nothing really material. So first I got this, ooh, focus. This is basically um, the menu of the beauty launch. I have several uh, things they offer in the beauty launch, nails, hair, and then even I think hair removal and then you can combine different things and you can actually book them also for events or parties or whatever so yeah so actually to go with that you have this magnificent voucher they gave they give you um for brown town is for a beauty launch so actually it's a 10 year old voucher that is um also a voucher this time for the Avida launch uh, for the Avida part in the beauty launch so actually it says that um as soon as you get a treatment, you will get also an Avida Scalp Detox treatment that is worth 10 euro. Okay, next on actually go into the goodies. So there's different samples that uh, were in this, in this goodie bag. So actually I have this. So this is actually a sample of the, the new J'adore Joy perfume. I didn't test it. I'm a huge fan of Dior perfumes. So you've got this. This is going to be a long, long vlog, sorry. And then you got um, this here. It's also a perfume from, I didn't know the brand. It's Frederick Mal. 
don't know if you see it. I, I don't know this one. Um, yes, it comes like this. I don't know what it smells like. I can do a review in like a later um, video. I don't know. I didn't try it yet. Uh, no idea, but I will definitely try it out. And then you have this um, Chanel sample, which is actually an anti-aging product with, can you see it? SPF 50. Um, yeah, I don't know if I need an anti-age um, product yet. I'm like still feel young but some people say you should begin in your early 20s and I'm going towards my mid 20s right now um don't know well well it says it's anti-aging and anti-pollution and it's the ultimate regeneration and complete protection so I'll definitely try it out you don't refuse Chanel and then finally you have this Clarence foundation sample for it says pore perfecting mattifying foundation which is actually super duper because um, I just bought new foundation like on a water basis because I feel like um, with my pores and with my oily skin um, if I use full coverage it will only amplify my bad skin and it will only make it worse but I'll definitely try this one out and um, nothing left in there but um, there was one more thing in there which I didn't uh, Oops, um, and it was this magnificent bottle of um, Prosecco. Love, 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 love. It was really nice. Um, uh, most of the um, girls were drinking it during the event. I couldn't because I knew I knew that I wanted to, um, <clears throat> well, uh, get back to studying after. So I didn't drink it, but I drank it at midnight, and it came with a straw. Reusable straw. I'm all for reusable re straws. I love them and it's so cute. It's so 50s style. Love it. Okay. And again, sorry for the long chit chat. I have no, I'm still adjusting to vlogs. I don't know how they function. This is my very first one. Um, I'll do an introduction video to my channel very soon, uh, but it will probably go up after this video goes up. Still need to figure out how I do all the editing and stuff, but I'm really excited because I had so much fun doing this vlog. And yeah, so I'll leave it here because this is going to be very, very long. Hope you enjoyed my video. I hope I didn't annoy you with all my chitty chat and me being new. And um, if you have any tips for a new vlogger um, who is really unexperienced in this domain, um, Leave comments down below and if you have yourself vlog channels or whatever and you need some little support I would love to look at them. I started binge watching vlogs like in December. I didn't know vlogs existed before that and yeah so um, actually together with this um, YouTube channel I'm going to put up a blog and a podcast series also so look below at the description please you will find the links any advice for me i would love that and see you in the next one and if you liked it subscribe please thank you bye